the modulus of x is minus x when x is less than 0, and x when it's greater than or equal to 0. For example, the modulus of 5 is 5, and the modulus of minus 5 is also 5. You basically throw away the sign to get the modulus. If x modulus is 5, then x is plus minus 5. If x minus says modulus is b, then x minus a is plus minus b. So x is a plus minus b. For example, solve 2x plus 3s modulus is 7. We get 2x plus 3 is plus minus 7. So 2x is either 4 or minus 10. Therefore, x is 2 or minus 5. Ace's modulus is equal to b's modulus. Is equivalent to a squared is equal to b squared. Ace's modulus is equal to b's modulus means a and b are either equal to opposite. A squared is equal to b squared also means a and b are either equal or opposite. Therefore these two are equivalent. We'll use this to solve modulus equations later. Now let's see how to sketch the graph of linear modulus functions. y equals the modulus of 2x plus 3. First, we sketch y equals 2x plus 3. Find two points on the line, 0 3 and minus 1.50 and connect them. This the line of y equals 2x plus 3. Since modulus can never be negative, we flip the part below the x-axis. This is the graph of y equals the modulus of 2x plus 3. It is v-shape. The left part is flipped up, therefore y values are negated. So it's y equals minus 2x minus 3 for x less than minus 1.5. The right part is y equals 2x plus 3 for x greater than minus 1.5. y equals the modulus of 3 minus 2x. First, we sketch y equals 3 minus 2x. Find two points on the line, 0, 3 and 1.50, and connect them. This the line of y equals 3 minus 2x. Since modulus can never be negative, we flip the part below the x-axis. This is the graph of y equals the modulus of 3 minus 2x. The left part is y equals 3 minus 2x for x less than 1.5. The right part is flipped up, therefore y values are negated. So it's y equals 2x minus 3 for x greater than 1.5. All linear modulus functions have v-shape. In this class, we learned, x modulus is the value without the sign. It is always non-negative. If the modulus of x minus a is b, then x is a plus minus b. Ace's modulus equals b's modulus, is equivalent to, a squared equals b squared. Linear modulus functions have v-shape. 